You're looking live at Amber Hankins and a cauliflower <laughs> bigger than her head. Yeah. Oh, so much bigger. That's happening. That's cauliflower, happening. we're Chef Amy in our kitchen. I love cauliflower. I do too. Mm -hmm. And when it tastes like steak, it's really good. I'm sorry, yes. you said it tastes like steak? Tastes like steak, I mm. promise. Does well, it? Mm. As much as cauliflower can taste like steak. <laughs> how, do you, how do you do I'm that? I'm not going to promise it tastes like steak. I know, but... we, were, I know we were doing magic. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so this is all the things you're going to learn on my plant-based cooking yes. class, you guys. I mean, January was fun. I went to Florida. We overindulged. No. Ah. Okay. And so okay. now it's back on. Yeah. Right. We're Florida, swimming. Florida does that to people. Yes, Florida's all like. the Bloody Marys, <laughs> all the sunshine. Question all you the, very quickly, yes. before we get into it, yeah. what does having a plant-based diet, like what are the advantages to so, that? Why okay. would one go that route? Here we go. Okay. Oh, I, I, am so not, <laughs> I am not a medical doctor. Right. All right, but like for me in my body, I get I get inflamed. Like if mm -hmm. I eat fried foods mm -hmm. or a lot of gluten. Mm -hmm. Okay. So for me, it makes me feel better. Okay. I don't necessarily like I'm not gonna like say, oh my god, you're gonna lose 70 pounds of weight in a week because right. you went right. plant based. This is to make yourself feel better. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and all look of, better, feel look, better. And I would there are too. some kids and adults who don't even eat any fruits or yeah. vegetables. Mm. So this at least is going to introduce you to new things. Okay. And how to, how to do it. Chef, all right. You, 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 have to, it, you have to call me out like that. I know. Some, I mean, some adults your, don't eat vegetables. Look, and fruits. Your friend doesn't eat my vegetables. My friend. This is, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> so you're with me. It's my friend that does all that stuff. Yeah. All right. So with the cauliflower steak, like we do this for our um, our vegetarian option for a lot of our weddings. So yeah. this is well received. Um, it does take a little bit of time, um, but we're going to roast it, and we're going to roast it like a steak. So you see okay. the big cauliflower that we had at the beginning? I do. So what we're going to do is cut it into a steak like this. Wow. And then what we're going to do is just kind Ooh, of add good. like all kinds. Like we're just going to drop yeah. it on there, and we're going to put it all in the crevices. So mm -hmm. why don't you get in there and just get all the crevices in there. Put you to work, there. Randall. Randall. Oh, I'm on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm working. Like you don't come to my kitchen and not work. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, all right. I'm in there. All right. <laughs> so what we're going to do is for the sauce, so I put it at 425, roasted it in the oven for about an hour. Okay. And you're going to take it in and out of the oven and kind of roast it again. Add some more liquid if you need to, like oil. Um, but then the sauce. The sauce is what makes it, you guys, all right? Okay. So we have a tahini sauce, which is like a sesame paste, mm. okay? okay? All right, so then what I'm going to do is going to add fresh lemon. Again, look, lemon. I love your knife. It's like a prop over here. Yeah. Talk about yeah. magic show That's tricks. That's a big knife. Jeez. Yes. All right, so, and then a little tip for you, a little tip that you oh, learned. A little tip. Seed side up. Seed sides up. Oh. And look how much juice came out. Okay. Mm. You don't need a juicer, guys. Don't need a juicer. Don't. <laughs> All right. So then we're going to whisk this. So we have the tahini. We have the lemon. We're going to do that. Now we're going to cut that because it's a little bit thick and pasty mm -hmm. with truffle oil. Now, if you watch TikTok, you know that this is like the thing. item <laughs> with the hot sauce, with the truffle. But I love to add a little bit of truffle. Okay. So we're going to add that. George, we need to be TikTokers. I, I know, George. That. You guys got to <laughs> yeah. get on it, TikTokers. get on it, yeah. get on it. Um, All right. So now what we're going to do, we're going to add a little bit more lemon juice. To, again, it's thin like, it out a little thin more. Thin it out a little That's bit thick. more. Tahini. Now, I got a dumb question about cauliflower. Is, yeah. there, is there protein in cauliflower? There is not protein in okay. cauliflower, but you can add protein to that. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. So like with the sesame and the tahini is adding a little bit of protein to that. So then, what I'm going to do, okay. a, little bit, a little bit more oil to okay. this. It got thick so quick. Well, it did. It's, 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 know, it's the yeah. big knife, I'm telling you. It's gonna, we're going to blame it on the knife. <laughs> All right, so then what I'm going to do is just kind of drop this in there and let that heat up again with the heated cauliflower right out of the oven. And then we're just going to add... A little bit of green onion on top. Well, just the fact that you offer to vegetarian catering, mm -hmm. that's, that's yeah. really cool. I mean, that is really big. I mean, they use us exclusively like vegans. Oh, my gosh. Huh. They love it. They Neat. love it. Okay, so real quickly, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. Now you can make plant-based dog treats. Oh, boy. Okay? Oh, so I, I did this yesterday was. with my doggies. They Let's were all I about me. Your dog. Yeah, look at the pictures of the doggies. All right, they're I so think they're cute. coming. Yeah. Oh, there they are. They're me the whole entire time. Oh, they knew yeah. it. They knew it. They knew what I was doing. So, so then cute. I made some like doggy macarons. Wow. And then you can just put that Th on there. Those look good. They do. Don't eat them, Randy. I'm very. I'm, I'm so glad. I know George was going to eat George. 
I was he was like, what is this? Don't look George, George had our eyes set on I that I know. Thing. So, again, <laughs> actually, the same thing with the dog. If you find that your dog, again, I'm not a vet, mm -hmm. yeah. but if you find the dog that's scratching and has allergies, put them on a plant-based diet. Mm. You can add protein to that as well, using vegetables, mm. too, that are high in protein, like lentils and beans. Nice. So, again, your dog cannot had the benefits yeah. of plant-based. Do you teach that type of stuff in your classes too? With no, the but they ask me. So that's uh, why okay. I felt like okay, you know, so there's a need there. to know. Yeah. Right. There's a yeah. need to know about dog treats. To answer too. questions. Correct. That's Correct. good. I think my yeah. dog would like these with little some snacks. peanut butter on them. I know. Yeah. There is yeah. a little bit of peanut butter in it. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Yes, yes. there Ooh. is a little plant -based peanut butter. Peanut butter. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We love you. Thank you so much. Scan that QR code on the bottom left hand corner of your screen to find out more in the